Hi, my name's Stephen Clary, and I'm a filmmaker and photographer. I'm also a Panasonic Lumix ambassador. In production environments, you may wish to record in higher quality than is currently available internally. In order to allow this, the S1H comes with a number of options available via the HDMI port. For example, to record 10-bit 4K 60p, you need to attach a compatible recording device, such as the Atomos Ninja 5 that we have here. External recording via HDMI to an Atomos or similar opens up possibilities to record in other codecs, such as ProRes HQ, giving you even greater recording bit rates. In order to set the S1H up for external recording, we need to navigate to the settings menu. Navigate down to the in out submenu and then select the HDMI record output option. To record externally, we need to turn off the info display and activate 4K 10-bit 422. The S1H and S1 and GH5 series of cameras come with an included HDMI cable lock. It screws into the side of the camera. This allows you to ensure the HDMI and USB cable won't come loose during shooting. You simply attach the cable tidy with a screw, which screws into the body, and then you plug in the HDMI lead and then wrap the cable around the cable tidy and you're good to go. It's really, really easy to use and just stops the clutter of cables around the camera. SDI will be more familiar to those coming from high-end cinema and broadcast cameras. Whilst SDI is often a more robust format and is better suited to long cable runs, for short camera to record a cable runs, HDMI offers a simpler and often cheaper option. For example, the highest SDI spec currently on the market is 12G, which means it's capable of transferring 12 gigabits per second, compared to HDMI, which has the maximum transfer rate of 18 gigabytes per second. The biggest benefit to HDMI in my eyes, however, is the availability of lower cost recorders. Many small external recorders only use HDMI and the SDI counterparts are often much higher in cost. If you need to integrate the S1H into an SDI setup, you can also purchase or rent a small HDMI to SDI converter. Alternatively, many monitors now come with a HDMI to SDI loop through for running SDI output to an SDI equipped wireless transmitter or similar. And that's the HDMI external recording options on the Lumix series of cameras. Panasonic.